I'd like to help you with the standard bunker shot. Uh, most people come to the bunker and they get a bit scared and a bit feared by sand and lips and bunkers. And one or two of the most common things I see is aggression, uh, steepness, angle of attack, and, and actually coming down into the sand far too hard and what we call digging. A lot of that is in the stance, um, being far too open. I can see here I've set some alignment sticks up. I've got my ball to target line at the target. I'm going to aim the club at the target. And the stance is open, but it's not ridiculously open. Some people get really open on this shot, and that's going to help you go down. And if you go down, you're going to dig. By squaring yourself up, you'll allow the swing path to be a little shallower into the ball. And this will help you to sort of kiss the sand and almost just take a few grains of sand. We don't want loads of sand in the bunker. We'll also make adjustment to the setup. We're going to take a nice wide stance. I like to see a nice wide stance. Wiggle those feet, get a nice footing, lower your centre of gravity. That's going to help you to use more body both ways. We're going to set the wrists, fully set the wrists. We're going to break the wrists in the backswing and we're going to reset the wrists in the follow through. Whatever you do on the way back, you're going to repeat on the way through. Let's have a go. So face, just a little bit open, nice wide stance, ball quite forward. Immediately break the wrist and then just caress it. Okay, let's have a little recap. Club face, slightly open, not too open. Stance, slightly open, not too open. Set the wrists, reset the wrists. Allow that club, allow the bounce of the club to kiss the sand and not dig. And your bunker play will improve.